My name's Alice Oakes, and I have three children who are on the autism spectrum. They get all the routine vaccinations. I think it's important both to keep them healthy and to keep them on their routine. The main challenges that my children have faced with going to the doctor and receiving vaccines are that it builds up a lot of anxiety for them. My kids get fidgety. If they're really nervous, they'll try to leave the exam room and go back into the reception area. And so it can be very difficult to sort of maintain them staying in the room and waiting to be seen. I really think that having something like this available where they have a positive connection that they can pair with that experience will be really helpful. The overall mission of the Autism Alliance of Michigan is to increase the quality of life for individuals on the autism spectrum, and that includes access to health care. So creating a sensory room is creating a space for individuals to come and know this has been designed specifically for them. Corner Health and other health facilities throughout the state of Michigan are putting in the time and effort to create more inclusive spaces. My name is Marquia Jones and I'm a family nurse practitioner here at Corner Health. I utilize the sensory room for patients when I feel like a traditional clinic room may cause them to be overstimulated. It's a safe space, a calming environment, and usually it allows patients to be less stimulated by seeing them or performing their exam in a sensory room. Traditional doctor's office setting might not be ideal for everybody, especially for somebody who has autism or some other sensory processing disorder, even for people who are just high anxiety. This is our sensory room at the Calhoun County Public Health Department, and we give immunizations here in this room. Sometimes when we bring kids in to get their shots, they're nervous or anxious, sometimes they're crying. They walk into this room and they just start to relax, feel so much better. Their parents start to relax, so it works really well. Autism Alliance of Michigan has been fantastic to work with. They're very knowledgeable. They're a fantastic resource for families, for individuals who have autism, who need resources, information, or knowledge. But they've also been really great for us as a provider because they too are providing us the information, the tools, the knowledge that we need to work directly with this community. One of the things that I noticed right away when we came into the sensory room was that there was a lot of space for Isaiah to sit on the floor and to engage with materials that way. And I think that that helped him a lot. It just felt calmer and more relaxing because I think they might not look forward to getting a shot, but they'll look forward to getting to go to that room and have the experiences that Isaiah had in there. One year from now, I hope to hear that the sensory room is being utilized on a regular basis and that there are repeat patients coming back knowing that there's a space for them at Corner Health. Five years from now, I hope that the sensory room is still in use and that it's become even more of a norm that we're seeing it here at Corner Health, but that we're seeing it at all different community organizations, whether it's a sports stadium or a health center. I just want to see more sensory rooms throughout the state of Michigan and comfortable spaces for those on the autism spectrum.